टुडे इज अवर टॉपिक दैट अनदर यूनिट नेम इज द लाइट राइट दैट इज योर यूनिट नंबर सिक्स वॉट आर द कंटेंट्स बिहाइंड ऑफ द लाइट विच आर नेचर ऑफ द लाइट लॉ ऑफ रिफ्रैक्शन एंड रिफ्रैक्शन ऑफ द लाइट मीन्स की रिफ्लैक्शन एंड रिफ्रैक्शन फीचर्स ऑफ द लैंड वॉट आर द फीचर्स ऑफ द लैंड लैंड एंड द इमेज द फिजिक्स ऑफ द विजन द डिटेक्ट ऑफ विजन एंड इट करेक्शन बायोलॉजिकल इफेक्ट ऑफ द लाइट यूज ऑफ लाइट इन थेरापी फोटो सेंसिटिविटी एंड एप्लीकेशन ऑफ प्रिंसिपल ऑफ लाइट इन द नर्सिंग this is the basic concept of the lights we have to study in this unit okay this one by one contents we have to studied by in a detailed manner first one general concept of the light what is the light the nature of the light what is the light means ki the nature of light of can be understood by following theories of the light means ki Who are proposed about of the light? These are corpuscular theory theory of the light, wave theory of the light, quantum theory of the light, and light at and interferes means ki these are the concept behind of the nature of light. Okay, first one. First theory, what is it? The corpuscular theory of the light. what is this theory tell us means ki what is that in a measurement about the light the corpuscular theory state that light is made up of tiny particles called as the corpuscles means ki the molecules means ki tiny particles of the light this is called as the corpuscle means ki little particles that always travel in a straight line means ki which is always travel in a straight line as according to the voice okay the voice is always travel by in a straight manner but light which is also travel by in a straight level next one newton what is the newton told us about the light newton developed the corpuscular theory of the light means ki newton who is the newton who developed the corpuscular theory of the light means ki the corpuscle the mean of the corpuscular we are already known this is the newton who is the scientist name who proposed about the molecules of the light means ki a uh, small particles of the light this is called as the corpuscular next one what is it this is the failure of the corpuscular theory of the light why the corpuscular theory which is a fail who proposed by the newton and why it is going to be fail to that debate portions we have to study the light bends around the corners obviously lights which is bend to the corners means ki which is called as refraction light travel faster in vacuum than in a material medium means ki which is vacuum means ki into the air and the pressure the light which is travel very fast into the pressure and the vacuum rather than into the solid or any other materials next one wave of wave theory of the light means ki what is it this is the magnetic electrical field this is the a is equal to field this is the magnetic field and this is only the field which is called as the edge this is the wavelength this is the wavelength we are already studied in the previous video it is the crisp and the thought which are made by the h and the e magnetic field and the only the field which are transferred by the direction of the propagations by the direction of the light right this is the radiation profile where the light which is range which are observed right this is the m this is called as the field this is the velocity means ki what is the velocity factor is there this is the electrical field how the electrical field which is a are spread over the potentiality so this is always by this in a changes manner next one here one of the light concept whenever we are talking about 
द प्रिजम थियोरी विच इज ऑलवेज कम्स इन अवर माइंड द वन वाइट लाइट विच इज रिफ्रेक्टेड पोर्शन कन्वर्ट इन टू द सेवन लाइट सेवन डिफरेंट कलर सेवन डिफरेंट कलर और द रेनबो कलर दिस इज कॉस्ड बाय अकर बाय द प्रिजम नेक्स्ट वन देन आफ्टर ह्यूजन प्रपोज दैट द लाइट विच इज ट्रांसमिटेड बाय waves through the materialistic medium means a light which is always travel by in a wave formation to the materialistic medium whatever materialistic medium which is transferred by in a wavelength factor in 1864 the clark maxwell proposed the electromagnetic theory of the light means in 1864 the clark maxwell who proposed the electromagnetic theory of the light these are the various list of the scientist we are talking about whose involvement into the proportional theory of the lights okay we are just understand a very basic concept we have to understand about the lights because we are not studied a proper physics we are only studied about related of the nursing related of the physics in the formation of the light so we are studying about the light and their proposed the theory in a basic concept in 1888 henrich hertz measured the electromagnetic waves described by the maxwell who described by the maxwell in 1895 hendrik anton hondrets advanced the, the idea that the source of the electromagnetic waves is the motion of इलेक्ट्रॉन इन द एटम ऑफ द एलिमेंट्स मीन्स की द मोशन मीन्स की द ट्रांसफरेटेड मोशन इन द इलेक्ट्रॉनिक एटोमेटिक फैक्टर मीन्स की द इलेक्ट्रॉनिक आइटम्स विच आर ट्रांसफर बाय दिस मीडियम वो प्रपोज बाय द हेनरी एंटोन हॉर्नेट्स एडवांस विच इज आइडिया विच गेट बाय द इलेक्ट्रो मैग्नेटिक वेव बाय द मोशन फेलियर ऑफ द वेव वेव थियोरी ऑफ द लाइट वाई इट्स गोइंग टू बी फेलियर ऑफ द लाइट थियोरी so like it failed to explain the photoelectrical field means ki it failed to explain the photoelectrical field photoelectrical field is a phenomenon in which electrically charged particles are released from or within a material when it absorbed electromagnetic radiation means ki photoelectrical effect what is that so it is the phenomenon means ki its concept in which by the electrically charged electrically charged electron proton neutron is the neutral so they are released when it is released from within a material whatever materials which are a transfer on it which is released by this charged particles from it when it absorbed electromagnetic radiations which is radiated factor means ki whatever area which is measured by the that particles So it it is depends on to the dense of the particles, right? So this is the releasing factor. Whenever we are attracting over here, the materialistic also releases over their charged particles as according to the refracted onto the solid factor of the positive or negative, as according to the opposite factor of the particles which are attracted over there. Next one, quantum theory of the light. What is the quantum theory of the light? So, like quantum theory of the light was explained by Max Planck in 1919. Max Planck who explained the theory of the light in 1919. Quantum theory of the light states that light has a particle nature, a uh, and a wave nature which is associated. It means that the quantum theory of the light which is state state that light which has the particles nature. what is the nature of the particle and what is the wave nature which is going to be associated over there this is the quantum theory of the light right next one here this is the radius factor one of the particles who are here one animated picture who take us about the field and their expanding in factor this particles which is observed by the waves means ki its energetic factor which is already expanded expanded and expanded next one light at an interference means ki light is invisible 
but make makes us to see things means ki what is the purpose of the light means ki what is the role of the light so light which is always make us to inv invisible to visible of the object a shadow which is formed when an opaque object is placed in the path of the light means ki shadow which is formed whenever light which is releases onto the object that time the shadow was observed that time which is by which manner which is formed by the opaque object which is placed in the path of the light the object intercept that the rays of light and the region in space where light does not reach is term as the shadow the object which is intercept the rays of the light and the region is space where light does not reach is term as by the shadow here some shadow factors which are appear means ki this is the man the light is a uh, passing by on it and the shadow which is formed right and another one here this is the solar eclipse example and this is the lunar eclipse this is the moon with shadow which is full shadow partial shadow you know about the solar eclipse and the lunar eclipse right the moon which is in between and their shadow which is observed onto the earth this is called as the solar eclipse what is called as the lunar eclipse in this factor between of the sun and the moon earth which is a between them as and their shadow which are observed this is called as the lunar eclipse okay so the here this concept we are measuring by that conditions here of studying about this example by the solar and the lunar eclipse which is caused by the refractions and the shadow factor which are a uh, which is hidden by this object this is the reason behind the light which is not passing by between us the obstacles and the conditions now what is the law of the refraction reflection and reflection of the light let us talk about them here this is the air and this is the water obviously whenever we are talking about the invisible factor that is air which is always consider and the known factor of the particles which is water so here we are taking about the passing through to the water air through to the water this is the normal angle this is the incident ray this is the reflected ray this is the angle of the reflection and this is the angle of the incidence and this is the reflector factor which are observed here this is angle of the reflections and this is refracted rays of this particle normal particles which is just a slant why because of this medium and their obstacles factor let's talk about them when light fall on the interference separating two media this is two media air and the water the light normal light which is passes by this two media one or all of three following process can be occur one or three process what is that the incident of the light or the part of it is turned back and that is reflected into the first medium the incident of the light or the part of it turned back that is reflected into the first medium what is the incident light a uh, the incident light is partly or completely absorbed by the second medium means ki the incidence of the light which is partly or completely absorbed by the second medium and a fractions of the incident light is transmitted that is refracted into the second medium as in case of the air water interference means ki a fraction fractions means ki a scattering is incident light which is transmitted which is refracted into the second medium as in the case of by air and the water if the interference which are appear next one reflections of the light what is the reflection of the light when a ray of light is incident at plane interference the angle of the incidence is equal to an of reflection means the ray of the light is incident which is at the 
plane this is the plane interference this is gives us to interference at the angle of incidence which is equal to at the reflection this is known as the law of the reflections this theory which is known as the reflection this is the incident light this is the reflected rays right this is the point of incident normal of interference and this is interference or the boundary this is the refraction of the light what is that the so when rays of the light travel from a rarer medium to a denser medium rarer to the denser medium it bends towards the normal to interfere spattering two media like refraction of light which is change in the direction of light when it pass from one media to the another means ki the refracted light which is change the directions when which is pass by one media to the another media here this is the law this is the substance one and this is the substance two this is refractions of the light this is normal this is the angle of the incidence which is the 90 angle this is ray this is refracted rays this is angle of the refraction this is the boundary this is substance one and substance two these two obstacles transmit by this media rays by this refractions of the light next one the speed of light which is changes when it goes from one medium into the another because refractive indices of different optical media are the different means ki as dependent which is depends on the change it goes by the light speed of the light it goes from one media to the another because refractive indices of different optical media are the different the refractive index of medium can be defined as the ratio of the speed of the light in the vacuum to its speed in a given medium whatever given media the light which will be transmit by the media depends of that media how it will be transmitted and what the let it go down transfer to absorb transfer and the speed this is depends on to transfer of that media now feature of the lens let us talk about features of the lens what is the features and what is called as the lens so following are the basic features of the lens we all know about the basic concept of the lens we are already studied into the small subjects of the uh, into the school portion this is the optical axis here in the green color this is the focal point the middle point this is called as the optical center there are two type of the lens are there convex convex and convex here this is the focal point which is the parallel rays which is transfer from to here on to the optical center by the optical axis the principal axis which is transfer here and the focal point which is called as the f the all the rays which are going to be summarized by this lens and this is called as the principal focus exactly our human eye which is called a uh, principal eye factor which is occur by on this manner which is called as the focal length next one what is it it is the line that passes through the center of the curvature of the lens means ki this is the curvature of the lens this is optical and this is the focal length the focal point and the focal length this is the principal focus optical center this is optical center what is it mean the center of the lens rays of the light which is passing through the optical center which do not change their direction means ki the middle of the portion the optical center will not going to be change the direction it is depends on to transfer as according to the straight manner lens middle portion this is called as the optical center this is the focal point this is principal focus this is the focal length right the parallel light which is passing by this factor when the parallel rays of the light pass through a convex lens the refracted rays converge at one point called the 
principal focus means ki the one point from its transfer by this principal focus which is the parallel light which is passed through to the convex refractor rate which is converged at the one point called as the principal focus this is the principal axis this is the focal point principal focus which is called as the f this is the auricle factor the focal length is the distance between the center of the lens and the focal point of the lens means the, the this is the lens focal length which is depends on to the center distance between the center of the lens and the focal point of the lens which is the optical axis this is the orific or optical center this is the parallel light which is transfer this is focal point which is focus factor focal length now what is the basic uh, physics behind of the vision let us talk about them the power of accommodation the ability of human eye lens to adjust is its focal length called power of accommodation of the eye the process by which the ciliary muscle change the focal length of an eye lens to focus distance or near object clearly on the retina this is called the accommodation of the eyes this is the accommodation of the human eye ability of the human lens which is adjusted by its focal length by the power of the accommodation of the eye and which is adjusted by the ciliary muscles where the the lens which is connected by the ciliary muscles and which is contracted as according to by passing of light on human eye lens right the distant or near object which clearly on the retina which is called as the accommodation of the light next one here this is the ciliary muscles this is the retina this is the lens the far points which are observed this is the near point where the ciliary muscles of the retina on it means ki which is depends on to the lens this is the proper lens and this is the abnormal lens nearer point and which is not some apparented ciliary muscles which is going to be observed the ciliary muscles which are connected by this lens and transfer the point and on to the making down of image on by the retinal factor next one now we are talking about the near point of the eye this physics behind of the eye and the image factor focusing we are talking about the near point of the eye the near point of the eye is the point of the nearest to the eye at which an object can be placed and still have a sharp image produced on the retina means ki this is the near this is the near portion of the retina the accommodation of the light which is transmitted onto the retina and the ciliary muscles which are already activated over there and the behind of the lens which is making down of image but this placed and the still have sharp image this time this is the sharp image which is produced on the retina this is the produced onto retina and for a normal eye the near point is located at the 25 cm from to the eye this is the d for distant near point 25 cm approximately this is object this is of the focus of the image onto the retina now defects of the vision and its corrections what is the defect of the vision and its corrections let's talk about that related of the focusing of the image by the eye and the lens factor this is hypermetropia this is called as long and slight ended myopia or the short this is called as the sight sight endedness presphophobia which is the far means ki sight endedness and astigmatism let us talk about in a detail about this visionary factor and the defect and their correction first one hypermetropia or long sight endedness a long sight ended person cannot see the near object distantly this type of person abnormal related of the retinal focusing factor 
this case in this case the patients would not going to be observe a nearest object by very clearly the near point is greater than 25 cm means ki if the nearest point is going to be 25 cm there is not greater than the 25 cm it is not going to be proper catch up in there the the is because the image of the object placed at the near point from the eye which is formed behind of the retina means ki here the focusing factor but the focal point is different factor because of the lens capacity which is less during of this condition see this is the long distance hypertrophia this is the normal here this is the normal and this is the reason behind of the focal point means the where is the focal point is uh, pointed over here and making down of image which is not possible and which is behind of the retina the image will be making down but it is not by the focusing this is called as the long sightedness factor defect why defect because the eye wall is too short means ki the eye wall is very short as according to the anatomy or physiological condition of abnormality the focal length of the lens which is elongated means ki the length where the image which is focusing the refracted by from to the uh, lens that the focusing factor point which is very flattened means ki very elongated very long along that term means ki very long this is normally seen in elderly person which is observed into the elder person correction this is corrected by a convex lens means ki which is corrected by the convex lens means ki we have to clear about this image by the convex lens next one myopia or short sight tenderness the short sight nets persons can be cannot see distance object distantly the image is formed in front of the retina the image which is formed by in front of the retina which is caused by elongation of the eye ball the focal length of the eye lens which is very short which is observed in a school or the college going children what is the corrections of the defect means ki concave lens which is used we are talking about the pre biopia or far sight tendedness you are already know about the things which is abnormalities of the vision for the eye abnormalities factors which defect is a long sight tendedness caused due to the old age which is the due to by the old age factor the lenses of the eye which are crystalline in nature and loss elasticity gradually with the age and the accommodation power of the ciliary muscles decreases like which is the reason behind so the accommodation power of the ciliary muscles which is caused by the decreases the ciliary muscles which are going to be decreased why the lens which is fitted by the ciliary muscles by the both the way but if the fitted means ki the muscles factors which is going to be old due to of that reasons the olding age of this conditions the lens which is not fitted down by the ciliary muscles simple the corrections of the defect which is corrected by using the bifocal lens means ki which is corrected by the using a bifocal lens here this is the normal vision this is the pre biopial reasons right this is the conditions which is caused by due to of the olding age right this is the focal point over here and this is the behind of the focal point this is the pre biopial factors right so here this is the ciliary muscles which is contracted factor during of that reasons the muscles fitted factor which is not so due to of that reason what is it called which is not going to be proper muscles which is contracted factor the loose contracted factor muscles of the ciliary muscles which is observed into the old age so that reason the pre biopial factor which is observed right next one astigmatism in this defect vision which is going to be blurred means ki the hazy regions has the visions which is observed causes it occurs when the cornea or the lens which is in regular in a shape the cornea and the lens shape which is going to be very abnormal or the irregular types which is first one irregular and the regular the types factor which is irregular and the regular irregular it is caused by corneal scar 
and it is corrected by the contact lens means ki which is corrected by this contact lens and this is caused by the corneal scar corneal scar which is the related of the il corneal factor and which is corrected by the contact lens means ki corrected factor by the contact factor it is due to irregular corneal or lens curvature of the eye means which is the due to by the irregular corneal or lens curvature of the eyes this is the regular next one impaired vision with the astigmatism which is normal eye vision here this is the lens which is corneal factor focal light lens and this is the one focal point behind of the eyes this is the astigmatic corneal which is the multiple focal point over here but the light which is going to be scattered not going to be combined at sight so this is the because of this regions the regions which are going to be blurred right this is the impaired regions of the astig astigmatism which is the corneal this is the iris this is the normal region this is the astigmatic regions of the eye okay here this regions which is going to be very scattered see the light which is going to be scattered over here this is the reason behind of the lens next one biological effect of the light what is the biological effect which is observed by the light the ultraviolet radiations act on the skin and are effective in the synthesis of the vitamin d which is the synthesis by the vitamin d uv radiated factor which is always going to be observed disease condition on our body which is observed by the skin and are effective in the synthesis of the vitamin d the uv radiations also stimulate the productions of the melanin by the melanocytes means ki which is observed by the melanin which is the point formations which is proteinated factor by the melanocyte means ki this is the skin formation amount of the absorb uh, absorptions of the calcium is influenced by the amount of light to which a person which is subjected the amount of the absorption of the calcium which is influenced by the amount of the light of person which is subjected the interaction of the light with some chemical results in toxic substances in the body that may result in the rash means ki what is that the interactions between the light with some chemical agents which result into the toxical factor substance by the body and that may result into the rash light which is used in the treatment of the jaundice in infants means ki light which is always effective means ki into the newborn factor the light exposures which is given to the joint uh, the pediatric patient for the avoiding of the jaundice factor if the bone jaundice which is occurred during of the congenital way so the exposure of the sunlight which is useful for the jaundice treatment here light is one of the most important factor that can affect the sleep means ki which is light is the one of the most important factor that can affect to the sleep obviously which is a, a, a interact to your eyes and the related factor uses of the light in a therapy means ki what are the using of the light into the therapical factor so first of all that is the application manner like visible light in medicine infrared ultraviolet radiation and the x ray these four factors of the light therapical factor which are used next one visible light in a medicine what is that visible light that is the range different different type of the range visible x ray ultraviolet these are the different different range factor which are observed by the light so visible light in a medicine so visual light which is used to get visual information about the patient mean this is the used by the patients about the information and obviously example color of the skin and part of the means ki color of the skin defect and there this is the way this is the way defect presence of the abnormal structures means the color of the skin to detect the presence of the abnormal structures which is presence by the abnormal structure and detect by the abnormal optical factor ent specialist examine the 
internal part of the ear nose or the throat using the light and an instrument called as the otoscope means ki ent specialist by the eye and the neck specialist and the uh, ear specialist most of all the ear specialist which is called as the ent surgeon examine the internal part of the ear nose and the throat using by the light means ki with the use of the visible light they are the the physicians which is going to be observe the part into internal physiological condition then after ophthalmoscope which is used by the ophthalmologist for examining the eyes means ki ophthalmologist who is to prepared for examining the eye and the physiological factor endoscopes lie cytoscope proctoscope bronchoscope etc used to view internal body cavity means endoscopes like what are that this is the cytoscope protoscope bronchoscope etc are used to view the internal cavity portions which is observed by internal means ki this is the by the use of the small camera inserted by our body and observe the internal organ very specifically in a manner trans illumination is used to study hydrocephalus and pneumothorax in infants means a trans illumination trans illuminated factor means ki the passing factor trans illuminated factor to study of the hydrocephalus and the pneumothorax into the infants means ki whatever abnormalities which is observed into the infants by the hydrocephalus and pneumothorax into body by the trans illuminated factor which is the one of the rays with the light which is passing by into that portion and observe the abnormalitical factor into the infants right visible light which is used in a treatment of the jaundice in infant obviously the visible light which is observed to use the in a treatment of the jaundice into the infants next one here some example i am taking down this is the endoscope this is the duodenum they are the, the this is the camera this is inserted into the portions and observe the abnormalities factors by this camera here this is the pneumothorax or the very baby uh, infants who are observed by the abnormalities by the visible light here some a phys a physics background this is very very small topic observe here for a range behind of the infrared this is the radio wave this is the microwave this is the infrared this is visible ultraviolet x ray and the gamma rays these are the different different type of the rays which are observed over here these are the wavelength in a nanometer this is the obviously the micro unit which is uh, only observed into the nanometer 400 450 this is the range of the radiations like infrared this is the radiation factor here we are observe this visible light by your naked eye okay next one first range name is the infrared radiation infrared like heat energy is transferred from the surface of the hot objects in the form of the infrared rays means ki the energy which is transferred from the surface of the objects in the form of the infra infrared rays infrared uh, infrared red rays are invisible and penetrate mist fog and the tissue of the body better than the visible light means ki this infrared rays which is the invisible we can't see by the our, our human eyes naked eye so which is penetrated by the mist fog and the tissue of the body better than the visible light infrared photography which is useful in certain cardiovascular conditions obviously the photographical factor which is useful in a certain cardiovascular condition here the radiation which is classified into two types near infrared and the far infrared this is always observed into two ways first one is the near infrared and the far infrared near and the far right infrared radiation heat the lamps and heat the pets are used to relieve muscle pain backache and the spondylolysis which is releasing by the radiation lamp by the heat pets which are used to relieved by the muscle pain back backache or the spondylolysis which is observed in the physiotherapy so this is gives to the physiotherapical exercise factor and this therapy gives to relieve by the backache and the 
muscles pain next one important applications of infrared radiations in a medicine is thermography means which is a radiations radiations which is used into the thermography thermo means ki temperature graphical representation of the temperature thermography is a photographical recording of heat which is emitted through the skin at various point on the, the body means ki the thermography which is a photographical recording of heat which is emitted through by the skin at the various point of the body the thermograph is an infrared camera can in addition to be in a extremely sensitive to the heat which is emitted by an area of the body which is able to transfer heat into the electrical current now what is the instrumentation by using of this infrared factor so let us talk about that which is camera which is addition to be in extremely sensitive which is very sensitive by the heat and which is emitted by an area of the body which is able to transfer heat into by the electrical current the heat which is transferred by the electrical current this is the instrumentation factor which are observed the current then operates the visible light of variable intensity that is a uh, recorded on a photograph film means ki which is recorded by on to the photographical film the current operates the visible light of visible intensity which is recorded on to the photographical film infrared which is used to also into the photographical film and the tumor have temperatures by 1 or 2 degree centigrade higher than those of surrounding areas which is a, a higher than area of the surrounding area so they can be detected by the thermograph means ki which is detected by the thermographical factor and the imaging factor which is observed next one use of thermography what is the application of the thermography to so, diagnosis of the tumor and the arthritis means ki which is diagnosed of the tumors and the arthritis effect of the drugs and other agents on the body means ki this effects which is observed by the drugs and other agents on the body in the diagnosis and treatment of the rheumatic disease which is a uh, observed into the diagnosis and the treatment of the rheumatic disease detections of the breast cancer and ocular disease which is the a uh, detections of the breast cancer and the ocular disease by this thermographical factor next one ultraviolet radiation what is that this is the ultraviolet factor it is of two types first one near by the uv radiation and far by the uv radiation first near and the second one is is the far by the uv radiation both which is produces chemical changes in the tissue which is uh, examination which is produce chemical changes by the tissue uses by the exfoliation vitamin d synthesis and bactericidal effect means ki these three factors which are observed by the chemical changes observed exfoliation exfoli vitamin d synthesis and bactericidal effect next one in the treatment of the rickets and the tuberculosis were the which is used into the rickettsial disease which is the one another morphological character of the microorganism that name is the rickettsial ricket and the back tuberculosis tuberculosis which is caused by the gram negative bacilli of the afb bacterial group who causes by the tuberculosis aerosol which are transmitted to these infections into the lungs and the alveolical sac as a counter irritant or uh, into the neuritis in the in the treatment of the skin this is like the psoriasis this is the cause for treatment disease into the psoriasis factor which is dangerous and precautions what is the danger and the precaution uv lamp may cause the conjunctivita and snow in a bright sunlight reflects large amount of the uv radiation means ki the snow in a bright sunlight and which is reflect the large amount of the uv radiation who causes the dangerous factor and the precautions factor which are observed next one x ray what is the reason behind of the x ray there are the, these are electromagnetic waves of very short wavelength of approximately 0.01 to 1 milli micron means ki 0.01 to 1 milli micron 
the X-ray factor. X-ray have great power of penetrations and when pass through the body, which affect a photographical plate and produce a negative picture of a shadow graph. Means X-ray have a great power of the body and which is the protections penetrations through the body and that is the effect of the photographical factor which is produce a negative pictures or a shadow graph structures and the tissues that allow the rays to pass through them easily appear by the dark on the developed film and that do not allow the rays to pass appear as lighter area on the film means ki the structure of the tissues which are a uh, penetrated x-ray which is penetrated by to the tissues and the muscles factor but which is not penetrated by into the uh, bones so the x-ray which is always used for the x-ray factors which pass them easily dark on the developed film and that do not allow to rays to pass appear lighter areas on the film type 1 and type 2 there are two types of the factors which are that the hard or the high x uh, energy x-rays and second soft or the low energy x-rays there are two type of the x-ray are there hard high soft or the low energy x-rays which are there hard and the soft x-ray are the hard x-rays are used for deep therapy and soft x-rays are used for diagnosis of the superficial therapy means ki there are two type of the factor hard and the soft hard x-rays which is used for deep therapy and soft x-ray again diagnose or the superficial therapy next one uses this is the x-ray ways are used in a treatment of the superficial lesions of the skin cancer and also in a irradiations deep lying tumors of the visceral organs visceral organs which are uh, identified by this x-ray treatment for the superficial lesions what are the lesions lesions means the defectivity or damaging portion by any kind of uh, traumatic condition or yeah, any, any uh, antibiotic factor or yeah, any infector factor there are different different type of the damaging factor lesion and factor which are observed by this x-ray for the superficial lesions when x-ray are passed through to the skull and the brain the air in a ventricles retard their passage and ventricles are outlined on the photographical plate. Next one, which can use to mark as the adrenal gland, which is observed by the adrenal gland. Certain chemicals like diodrets and opaque to x-rays, which don't do not pass through the organs without this chemical, the organ appear as light shadow on the developed plate, which is observed by the, on the developed simple student. See, which is observed onto the developed plate by the X-ray factor, but the gland, the hormonal secretions by the adrenal gland, this is up here. The miniature radiographical tube, which is used to obtain the pictures of the teeth and the jaws, means the miniature radiographical tube, which is used to obtain the picture of the teeth and the zoo. Next one, photosensitivity. What is the sensitivity by the light or the photo? The photosensitivity is inflammation of the skin which is induced by the combinations of sunlight and certain medications or the substances. Means ki, the photographical factor which is this is photosensitivity by the sun. Sensitivity inflammations which is occurred by the sunlight which is combination of sunlight and certain medications or the substance. Exposures to the UV rays can also lead to the skin damage and skin cancer. Means ki the UV exposures which is also lead to the skin damage and skin cancer. Next one. People who are photosensitive may develop skin rashes or burns even after only limited exposures to the sun. Means ki people who are photosensitive which may develop by the skin rashes or burns and even after only limited exposures to the sun. Now, phototoxic reactions which is caused when a new chemical in your body which is interacts with the UV rays from the sun. 
medications like the doxycycline and the tetracycline for example are the most common causes of this type of the reactions phototoxic reactions which is caused by when a new chemical which is absorbed by interact with the body with uv rays from the sun and medications by the doxycycline and tetracycline which is example of the most common causes of this type of the reaction the result is a skin rash that looks like a severe sunburn which usually develops within a 24 hours of exposure to the sun which results by the rashes which is looks by a severe sub sunburn which is observed by the sunburn and which usually develop within a 24 hours by the excessive amount of the sunlight exposures onto the skin which burns on the superficial layer of the skin this is called as the sunburn right next one applications of principles of light in a nursing this is important why should we uh, used to or the important into the nursing study of principle of light will help nurses to understand uses of light in different health care practices refractive errors and corrective measures by using different lens use of light in different diagnostic diagnostic tools use of light in management of different medical disorders like treatment of skin problems and the cancer etc first of all health care practices refractive errors and corrective measures by using different lens use of light in different diagnostic tools use of light in management of different medical disorders like treatment of the skin problems and cancer etc nurses will be able to understand the biological effect of the light on the human body means ki nurses will have to understand able to understand the biological what are the various biological effectivity into the therapeutic portions by the light on the human being and to understand the mechanism of the photosensitivity to understand the mechanism of the photosensitivity factors